Hey there, here's a quick tutorial I was going to show. So when I create a business card, I create it in your typical business card size in InDesign here. So as you see, here is a blank business card. And the layout is here, I'll show you. Three and a half inches wide by two inches wide. That is your typical business cards layout. Okay, so I'm going to file, export, Adobe PDF. Go ahead and save that. I'm not doing any Marshall Bleeds on this. I'm just doing the regular business card. I do high quality because I want a high quality image. That should be exported and saved. So I'm going to go ahead and close this. I don't want to save anything. So now I'm going to, need to look in my business card folder where I saved it. I called that one little little blank because it's just a blank one. So here we are now in Adobe Acrobat PDF where I'm going to use quite imposing. So as you can see, here is your card. We got Adobe Acrobat PDF. I'm gonna select the card and I'm hit control. And control copy it where I can have 10 versions of the card put together here. So now I'm gonna go up under plugins to quite imposing and in up pages. Sheets will not be trimmed. Place full size. Next. I'm going to want at least a 0.25 at the edge of the sheet, but I don't want any spaces between my cards. So they're going to sit right up next to each other, but I am going to add crop marks. US letter 8.5 by 11. I went ahead and put columns 0, max rows 0, so it knows to put the put that amount on there and align I'm gonna do center so it all goes from the center page finish and now we have our cards with crop marks so when we run it through the card slitter it'll cut each card into the individual cards and that's how you set up your business cards in quite imposing thank you for watching